afternoon now at 10. What if your favorite restaurant or store made you pay your bill based on your salary? A new pop up shop in New Orleans is exploring this concept and it highlights the gender wage gap and what it costs women who are paid less than men. WDSU's Casey Friend is live now in studio tonight. And Casey, what is the wage gap in New Orleans? Adriana, according to the American Association of University Women, women in Louisiana earn 66 cents for every dollar that a man makes. In the same profession. Now, the average annual income in Louisiana for a woman is $31,865 compared to $48,318 for men. That's worse than the national average, where women earn 76 cents to every dollar. But for this month only, at least at one store, women in New Orleans will only have to pay what they're paid. On Aretha Castle Haley Boulevard, a street named after a woman who defied social injustice, fighting for local stores to hire black salespeople and provide equal access to stores for blacks. I hope for social justice. I hope for fairness across the board. These women are fighting a current injustice, a wage gap that has women in New Orleans earning 66 percent of what men earn. I think the striking thing about that statistic isn't just that um, women are generally making less than men; it's that they're making less than men doing. The same job. Osa Atoy is a part time teacher who makes and sells pottery. Her work is being featured alongside 45 other local female artists in the less than 100 store, where women pay less than men because they're paid less than men. Everything on here um, has two sticker prices there's a green sticker for men, and that's 100%, and then there's a yellow sticker for women, which is the 66% price. Um, I think it's a great way to just address the problem. Obviously, we can't solve the problem through this shop, but I think it's a good way to just raise awareness. Awareness about an issue that affects like such a huge cross section of people. Tammy Mercure helped bring the store to New Orleans after a friend started the concept in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. It adds up. It, it means like less groceries. It means maybe you don't have the same type of car. Maybe you don't get places. For people who have families and um, are trying to make ends meet and who need to be making a living wage, um, I feel like wage parity is a huge issue. This isn't a group of women pushing a feminist agenda. They say men are allowed to choose which price they want to pay. Everybody's super excited to pay the 100% and support women artists. The fight may have been ongoing for years, but these women say the store is a step toward beginning the discussion in a real and understandable way. Now, if you're interested, this store is open Tuesday through Sunday from 12 to 7 p.m. until November 30th. And the origi originator says she plans to take the shop to other stores uh, in the city uh, throughout the nation. And she says she wants other cities to con consider um, having an entire day where women can pay where they're paid at all stores.